So we had a fair amount of rain uh, last 24 hours or so. Um, this is one of those new 2811 strings, the ones that are uh, completely injection molded with silicone. And I talked about the problems with uh, the wires on these uh, pulling back on here. Um, and again, you can see I just kind of got this draped over the side here. Um, I came out to check these today and I really wanted to show what's happened with this one. Um, and you see, I, I haven't been real rough or anything on these, but you can see that this silicone is pulling back here from the wires. And if you actually look, let's see if I can get it lined up here. You can actually see all the way down to the circuit board. Um, you can see where that's just letting go of the wires. Um, and if I rock this back and forth a little bit, hopefully you can see... Um, See how it gets darker there, right at the circuit board? That's just full of water on the inside. Um, and this was sitting basically just as you see it, um, just with the, the lens pointed straight up. Um, we didn't have a real hard rain. We didn't have any really bad, nasty weather. It was just kind of a, a gentle soak. Um, we got maybe a quarter to a half an inch that fell over like six or eight hours. Um, just made everything out here really wet uh, for a long time. But um, these things, you know, they sound good in, in theory and concept, um, but that soft silicone, it just, it's having all the same problems that we had with, with the very first um, pixel nodes that, that we had over two years ago. Um, we had all the problems with the silicone and the and the wires um, and these are just the the same thing um, so I wanted to show everybody that I know we're looking at different pre-order stuff um, and I know everybody's excited about these 2811s because of the price point um, unfortunately I think it it is just kinda like the old adage goes you know you, you're gonna get what you pay for um, I've kinda gone down down the string and you know most any of them that were hanging where water could run down that that string um, they're squishy like that one on the inside um, so I unplugged these right now um, I don't I don't have them hooked in because I'm afraid if I do I'm either gonna blow a fuse on my uh, my controller um, or I'm just gonna you know bake the LED um, so I'm gonna let these dry out a little bit and then try to plug them in and see if they still work um, and then I'll probably take some of these that I, I know were bad. Um, I'll take that apart and see if I'm getting any rust inside. 